Good day, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of the Albino Rhino Beer Review. Today you have the Rhino, and we're going to drink a beer. Maybe I should practice my French. I mean, Bill 96 is coming out here in Quebec soon. Um, and I know I'm in Nunavik, so you would think, hey, you're not in Quebec, but we're still part of Quebec. So if Bill 96 passes, sure, a Nuktatuk might be protected here, and they might say in town you can speak English, because English is the second language in Nunavik, for the most part. But anytime you have to communicate outside of Nunavik, doctors, lawyers, social services, uh, Canada Post, and it's going to have to be in French, so I'm going to poulet frit. I have so many very angry French people that watch this channel that are from here in Quebec, and they're like, oh my god, you, you, you heathen piece of shit anglophone that makes fun. I don't make fun of your fucking culture, but if your culture is the you have to speak French or you can go fuck yourself, your, your culture is fucked. I mean, anywhere else in Canada, we have to make sure that you can be offered things in French and English. And I mean, in all honesty, our second language should probably be... Our, our second official language should probably be like Ojibwe Cree or uh, or Inuktitut or, or uh, something in the Dene Nation or something like that. But it is French, and so yeah, you need to be able to get French too. But in Quebec, it is now going to be French and French only. There's going to be a lot of people leaving. This is Fernie Brewing Company's Mango Pineapple Sour Enduro, and it's 5% alcohol by volume. It's a flavored beer, and I believe Fernie is BC, is it not? Uh, just trying to double check here. I've had some things from Fernie, I do believe. Brewed and packaged by Fernie Brewing Company. Uh, Fernie BC, yeah, okay, so I was right, it's BC. Now, you know, I find it funny that Jasper, up in the mountains, just had, it had beers from BC, all over the US, uh, New Brunswick, I find that amusing that in the mountains of Alberta, you get better beer choices than in some places in Ontario other than maybe Toronto. Uh, sent out of the can. Okay. Out of the can, that smells like a really sulfuric fart. A really sulfuric fart. I'm not liking that. Glass, it looks beautiful. I mean, that beautiful golden yellow color, slightly off-white head. Nice snap, crackle, pop, what's it smell like out of the glass? It smells like a slightly sulfuric fart. Cheers. So I'm going to guess that this was, uh... I'm going to guess this was kettle soured. Probably lactobacillus. I don't know for sure. Um, I didn't really read anything on there. But that usually gives me that slightly sulfur sulfuric scent. Let's try the beer. Slanche. Ooh la la. Okay, smell might not be good. Look is great. Taste is pretty good. It has mango, it has pineapple, and it has sourness. The mango and pineapple are watered down, which is perfectly fine. Um, the sourness is more to a tart level than full-on mouth puckering sour, which is also fine. It's approachable for other people. And that's what you kind of want, is it not? I like this beer. I'm trying to be quick, so, and I did go on my little French tirade there that's probably gonna piss people off. I don't care anymore, like, I don't. I'm three years of just, well, almost three years of, of COVID and everything. I, I, I've lost my ability to just keep my mouth shut. Very easy drinking beer. Eight out of ten. Thank you. Bye.